Hi, I'm Adrian Richardson. Barbecued Portuguese chicken is a classic. It's one of my favorite dishes, but you know what? It's all about the marinade, which is what I'm gonna teach you today. Now, you can use this marinade on halloumi, you can use it on vegetables, but I'm gonna show you a sneaky way of putting it on salmon. It will be delicious. It starts with some roasted red peppers. What I did with these peppers is I rubbed them in some olive oil and I put them on the ziggy. Turn them around a few times till you get a black skin on the outside. Pop them into a bowl, cover them with cling film. That makes them sweat a little bit and easy to peel. Remove the seeds, chop them nice and fine. And the reason we do that is we get a really, really nice smoky flavor and that is the start of it. To that, we're gonna add some garlic. I've got about a teaspoon of chopped garlic, chopped nice and fine. And some some smoked paprika, about a teaspoon of that. I love that smoky flavor. That's what this dish is all about. Now to add a bit of sweetness, I've got some sweet paprika and I'll add two teaspoons of that. Now this is some ground cumin. You can toast it if you want, but it'll get plenty of toasting on the ziggy. And coriander, nice and finely ground, about a teaspoon of that as well. Now I love red onion, so I'll add about half a red onion diced really, really fine. And for the extra bit of spice, I've got some chili. One chili diced up nice and fine as well. Now we need some fresh herbs here. So I've got some coriander, parsley, and spring onions. And I like to bunch them up together and chop them nice and fine. With a good sharp knife, you run your knife through the end of it like this and just pop them in your bowl. Nothing beats the smell of fresh herbs. Now I've got a lemon here and I'll slice it in half. I wanna have a bit of lemon juice in here. And a little trick is to squeeze the lemon juice through your fingers like this, and that way you catch all the seeds. Now to add some flavor, we've got some salt and a good pinch of that, and some cracked black pepper. And also to lubricate everything and make it even more tasty, I've got some extra virgin olive oil. Mix it around until everything is combined. And then I'll grab my salmon here. Smear the marinade all over the salmon. Now normally I'd pop this into the fridge for about an hour to get all those flavors in here. But I reckon it smells so good, so I'm gonna get it on now. This barbecue is powerful enough to cook with the lid up or down. If you've got thicker cuts of meat, pop the lid down. It'll help to keep that meat moist and juicy and tender. Even though the Ziggy looks compact, it's got enough cooking space to cook for a crowd of people. Now I'll just pop the salmon off here like that and then pop it onto my plate. You can see I've served it with my favorite green vegetable salads. Now I'm gonna tuck into this fish, but I'll squeeze some lemon over the top of it. And I've got that marinade and the peppers and the smell is amazing. I'll cut a little piece of this fish. Mm. Moist, juicy, flavorsome, that smoky flavor as well. This is a beautiful piece of fish and a great barbecue to cook on. <laughs>